Hey guys, I am Kyle and in today's video, I am going to show you how to use G Suite for beginners. Alright, so now here we are in workspace.google.com or Google Workspace or basically G Suite. It's basically the same. And then from here, what we'll be discussing in this video is we will be talking about what are the inclusions of the uh, premium plans of Google Workspace and so on right here. So when you scroll down right here, you can see the features on what you can get on Google Workspace, but we're going more in depth. So to do that, we need to click here on the pricing. And then from here, you can see the pricing or the prices of the plans. And then when you scroll down, you would see more detailed uh, information about the features that you will get. So the first one is choose your Google Workspace pricing plan and you have a 14 days free trial right here so these are your plans you have the business starter business standard business plus enterprise right here these are the prices right here six six dollars twelve dollars and eight dollars for business plus and you would need to contact the sales if you are interested for enterprise right here and then as you can see right here the features would increase as the price increases right here so yeah you have custom and secure business email right here for every plan. So this is very important because this is what you would call, uh, this would make your email more professional because it won't have the at gmail.com at the end. Instead, it would have the at the domain that you have right here or the domain that you would choose when you get started for your business starter right here. So in short, you would be able to create your own domain with this one right here for your email right here in any of these plans right here. And you have 100 uh, participant video meetings, 30 gig of uh, storage, and two terabytes for business standard, and five terabytes for business plus, and five terabytes for enterprise, and so on. And you have your security and management controls. This is very important because this would make your uh, uh, workspace more secure and more manageable because you would have it right here which we'll be uh, talking about in depth later on you would have it right here so yeah and then when you go here into products by the way you can see the the see all apps right here and you can see here in the security and management you have your admin endpoint vault and work insights uh, the Probably the most important one here is the admin because you can manage your uh, workspace and so on. And then your work insights, which you can see the trends of your work habits, your patterns and so on. So that is also very important. And you have your standard support right here. Unless you would want to go for enhanced support, then you should upgrade to a better plan right there. And yeah, as you can see the benefits would only increase as the prices increase so you can just uh, dig more deeper into this one so we'll not dwell that deep into this because I'm just gonna save your time and then from here we're just gonna scroll down and we can compare the plans in detail so as you can see right here in the productivity and collaboration section you have your G your gmail business email it means you have your custom business email you have your phishing and spam protection that blocks 99% of the attacks and add free email experience right here and you have your google meet which has uh, a very big uh, limit so you have your 100 participants and maximum length is a one day right here or 24 hours and some other features right there and you have your google drive which is the storage for the business starter you have your 30 gig and two terabytes for business standard business plus is five terabytes and the same is for enterprise and the next one you have your chat team so this is basically where you would be chatting or you will be conversing with your teammate or whatsoever right here this is where you will be planning and you have your calendars wherein you can uh, book your meetings or maybe mark some dates right here on the important events of your uh, company or maybe workspace right here and of course you have your google docs sheets and slides so if you don't know what this is this is basically where you would be creating your documents, your PowerPoints, just like that. You even have your Excel sheets, your slides, and so on. So this is basically it right here. And you would have it all right here. As you can see, it's all checked for all plans right here. It's basically the same. 
and you can click here and see more features right here and as you can see only the business starter doesn't have the custom branding for document and form templates and then the rest of the plans would have it right here but that is the only difference right here in terms of the uh, docs sheets slides and other collaborative content creation apps right there and then you have your app sheet build apps without code so this one if you are interested in building apps you can do it right here without coding so if you are a total beginner that is no problem you can use the app sheet by google so you can create your an app for yourself or for your company or for your workspace right here and i have a tutorial on that so if you're interested you can go and browse my videos and you can see my app sheet tutorial on this one and then you have your security and management right here so this is also very important this would make your management to your workspace very easy and secure so if you have this you can click here on see more features and you will see more features right here that would be included into your plan so you have it here so yeah you can just uh, freely explore this one and you have your uh, security center you have your data regions access transparency and so on right here so that is basically it for the features just a quick run through on what you would get and then you could try google workspace for free so we will be doing that later on and then you have your uh, add-ons right here and remember these are separate so you would need to pay more if you would want this you, you have your do it ai your hardware applications and so on but this one is already included this one and this one also this one is not i think i'm not sure but yeah you can check that out for yourself and then now let's go and click on get started so now we can uh choose the plan you can pay for it or you could try the 14 day free trial so click on get started right here and then from here all you have to do is do is place your business name just for an example and then let's say i'm uh, just a solo one and click on the region and click on next once you're done and the first name is just like that and i'm gonna go for that and i'm gonna place my current email address just like that and we will be able to change that later on into our own uh, custom mail right here so as you can see we have here with a yourcompany.com address or just a basic gmail.com address so I recommend that you choose this one because this is more professional. So when you click on select right here, you would be able to provide your domain. This is what uh, would come after, after the, uh, or this would replace the at gmail.com in your mail. If you can see that, then you can just use this right here and you can have the no, I need one if you don't have one, or you can choose yes. If you already have a domain right here for your company, or uh, let's say just for an example, right now just like that and i'm gonna click on next right there and as you can see this haven't been purchased yet because that is just an example or you can just go here and you can search for your domains right here and as you can see you would have this right here so you can also do this right here if you would want to so you can uh, find a domain of your own right here if you would go for a premium plan here on google workspace and basically the rest of the steps after this is very much personal you would need to provide your car details for the payment and your personal information and so on so i won't be going through that since it's just a personal one you won't need to be guided for that so yeah that is basically it for the tutorial i hope this video helped you out thank you for watching